Hello everyone, Joe Bexy here. Welcome to Let's Play Prismata. We will see how we do. Alright. Let's see, we get Cluster Bolt, Grenade Mac, Apollo. I don't know how I feel about Cluster Bolt. Grenade Mac is bought, can check three pixies. Sounds like a great plan. Apollo. I like Apollo. Shadow Fang is good. Chieftain is Chieftain. I don't know. So not a lot of cheap stuff in there too. Everything's going to take some uh, investment. I'm going to try to go for the grenade mech and Apollo. Maybe not exactly in that order, but... Yeah. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. I'm saving the two money from the previous turn so I can come in and have more because I'm going to need to construct two blast forges. Now I can afford a grenade mech. And he's not going to have a way out. got a gauss cannon that's to make me have a wall that's okay it's not gonna set me back probably actually a good decision for me to do that anyway so I can have access a to a defense and a greater income as I keep popping out these grenade mechs because I can have 10 one damage not a problem hey look it's a grenade mech and a drone. There are my three pixies. If I want to come in swinging, he's going to need a wall this turn. I can afford it. I think he's going to go for the Apollos. I should also. If I come in swinging now, he can save his wall by sacrificing his two engineers, but then he can't uh, really do anything else. Um, and I should have another... Well, let me see. I can afford an Apollo. Oh, I can't because I don't have the other Blast Forge. I can afford another Grenade Mech. Um, I'm coming in swinging with four. He's going to need to sacrifice two Engineers if he wants to keep that wall alive. It's okay by me. Okay. He's hitting me for two this turn. I'm okay with that. There's his engineer coming back. Two coming in. Should I let him keep a wall? There's a grenade mech. Drone city. If I leave a drone off, I can construct a blast forge. Should I hit him for three? I'll hit him for three. I'll hit him for five. There's no use hitting him for five. I'll hit him for three. That's what I like about Pixies. It's moderated uh, damage. If you need five damage, you can have exactly five damage. If you need exactly 12 damage, you can have exactly 12 damage. No more, no less. You don't have to guess when it's three. You can see it's a magic number. <sighs> Come roll in all the riches all around you, and for once never wonder what they're worth. The rainstorm and the river are my brothers, the heron and the otter are my friends, and we are all connected to each other. Yeah, I might have this. I don't know. How many more grenade mechs can I get? I think the answer is yes. Apollo. 
Mm, should I get the- I should get the Apollo next, because then I can just start saying, yeah, that wall you have? Go on. Freeze coming in, goodbye, engineer. Okay, we'll deal with that later. There's an Apollo. Ooh, no, not yet. Not yet. Bring it back. Grenade mech, we're gonna pop in some more drones. Um... Eight is what his defense is nine. So if I roll with eight, he has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, six, seven, eight. So he saves the wall no matter what. Excuse me, if I come in with three, he just kills an engineer. If I come in with two, I'll just come in with three. Okay, so he kills the force field. Okay. I could use some more defense. I should probably build a wall next turn. I can just keep popping out grenade mechs. I don't know why you could buy 10 of those. Excuse me, I feel like that's excessive. Hey, thanks for the Gauss charges. Okay, so now he's going to try to apply some pressure. It's good. Alrighty, um, two walls should suffice, and I can instill for it a, no I can't, one wall? Okay, um, it has to be a wall too, because I can't afford, well I can, I can sacrifice the drone, uh, so I can have another grenade mech. I can build another drone and engineer. My, yeah, that's all going to be dead, though. Six, uh, will that overrun? Yeah, it will. And I can kill a Gauss charge. can't kill a gas charge. Uh, I can kill a drone though. So I shall. Yep. No more. Yeah, gauss charges can't stay. Of course now I'm out of pixies. And he's out of gauss charges. <laughs> so I don't know, it's still not clear he's winning. I have more money making capacity though. That's usually an indicator of some level of success. Okay. Of course, I'm also out of walls, which I'll need. Ooh, never mind. He's bringing it back. I do like the undo capacity of this game. It is nice. I can make all the stanks I want, and I should be fine. <laughs> I can overrun his defenders easy as peasy. Uh, he popped in another couple Gauss charges, though. Let's pop in some walls. I can make three walls. Uh, and a drone. I'll make three walls and two engineers. Um, I'll overrun some defenders. Should I actually pop in three more? He'll kill three of his drones, make it harder for him to make money. I think that blow to the drones is going to be sufficient to win me the game. I think that's the turn that wins me the game. Because he can hit me for eight this turn, sure, and I've got three walls. But, I mean, he I don't think he has the money-making capacity to come back from that. 
They may not even need Apollos. I can just grenade max all day every day. I win. Okay. Good game. Puts me back up to 898. Excellent! Climbing the leaderboard. Climbing the rankings. That was fun. Alright, let's play some more rank, shall we? Oh, oh! Jump XC versus Epsilon Delta! Alright, we have a Fission Turret. Uh, interesting. Zamora Voidbringer. Ooh. Takes six turns to construct, but that could be rocking the house once you get there. More Antimakama. I think I've exploited that enough and been spoiled enough. Emperilla is really good if you want to go for the Tarzier approach. I want, may want to um, experiment with um, Zamora Voidburner. There's a conduit. Looks like I'm not the only one. Popping out a conduit and a blast forge next turn. Because as much as I want to go in hardcore, I'm going to need more than that. Okay. okay. Uh, nope, that's not the one I want. Good. Affords me a drone. Uh, two turns from now, I can get Zamora Voidbringer. It's a six turn investment. And then I'll need as many conduits as I can get. Six is good, seven is better, eight would be optimal. So... I can turn war into money with a militia. That sounds about right. Um, I'll build a wall though, that way I have one. He also built a Zamora. Uh, I'll build another conduit. And I can't afford a Zamora just yet. So, it's just gonna have to be where it is. Wowzers! There's a Tia Thernax already. Where's mine? Need more walls. This is not good. Um, I guess I need an Animus after all. Also, a Tia Third Axe, if I'm ever going to hope to put the same amount of pressure on. I need that next turn. She's not as cheap as she um, sounds. She consumes seven drones. Dangerous. It's too much. Too it's too expensive. I need this more void bringer. I 
fission turret, I guess, is what you need to make some more uh, functional, but it's just too pricey. This is all terrible. Terrible, absolutely terrible. I need two more engineers. So I could use fission turrets, I guess. Pretty terrible business. Seven's coming in. Right, you see, the trouble is now I need to focus on building walls. This is terrible. Absolutely terrible. I can afford a fission turret now. The Tia Throne next, you can only swing in with it one more time. And then it can die. So I'm not lost yet. He's ramping up on those conduits, though. I think I need to use Sinestra. Just to keep up. Sinestra. Yep. Sinestra it is. Third X swing, swings in with seven this turn, yeah. So it doesn't get destroyed next turn. I was too slow with the Zamora. Just a bit too slow. <clears throat> All righty. He's coming at me. Rhino coming in. Yes, I know. The, the, the Zamora. Now everything that's still visible is going to die. I'm still in bad shape. Okay, now that doesn't have to happen. Okay, I have 11. I can construct another Sinestra. I can't. Uh, two conduits. Three conduits. 
Okay, it's dangerous. We're gonna make it work, I hope. He's swinging in with all he's got. I still got three more turns on my Zamora. And an Amparilla. No! I'm doomed. Tarsier's. He's out of my reach at this point. I'm behind the curve. At least one of my walls gets to live. Wall. It's just too fast. It's a new life. Can't do that. Have the blast forge so I can get more walls next turn. It's probably too late. There's a third X. T a third X. No, because she'll just get destroyed. Right now. I'm gonna get overrun. Nope, I lose this one. That was a good game though. Phew, I gotta get better at that. Thank you so very much for watching this episode of Let's Play Prismata. If you like what you see, be sure to click the video on the left to be taken to my Prismata playlist, or you can click the video on the right to be taken to a random video in my channel. And of course, there's always the opportunity to click subscribe to be notified when I produce more excellent content. Thank you so very much for watching, and I will see you in the comments.